I am Carla Romualdo. I am from Mexico. In my particular case, I have a license, like a bachelor's degree in communications. And then I had already five years and a half of experience in different areas of communications. I was interested in this master's at the beginning because it combined both the management of in, uh, luxury brands, yes, but it also had a focus on global brands in general. You have something that it's called the winter session. You are able to have about a two week intensive course of two subjects in another country. I think it's something very cool and it also allows you to uh, get closer to people uh, because you get to meet people from other masters that are not necessarily yours. So it allows you to open your connections and meet more people. So I really like that. I really enjoy the the life in in the city because it's a very sort of student focused life. It's a very young city in in a way. The thing that I liked the most about Rennes was uh, the Marché de Lys. It's one of the biggest ones for fresh products in in France, and it has so many great things. I love to go in there. Actually, I went there during all the time I was in Rennes every Saturday religiously. And also they have this huge library, which of course is not the biggest library in the world, but it's quite a decent size for like a, a city that it's not a capital city. I was still working up to the moment I was accepted in the program. The moment I was accepted in the program, I quit my job and I took one month of intensive courses to try to get as far as I could before arriving to France. Because even though I knew the courses will be in English, I was well aware that to make friends in a foreign country and to live a day-to-day -day life, it's, it's just easier to know the language, even if it's just a little bit. So yeah, to answer, I arrived and I spoke a bit of French, but um, not that well. Just enough for a day-to-day -day life. It's important for them to understand the French school system because it's different in every country. And in some countries, like mine, uh, you are doing the same things at a later uh, time in your life. So for example, when I arrived at the course, I realized I was the oldest person there. I do feel like it something it's something that I should have done when I was younger I didn't know otherwise I would have but uh, I do think it's important to see how it's different it, the school system can be different in different countries so you can better prepare yourself for what you are going to do <laughs> <laughs>